Today's video is a review of the Mutis M30 Massage Gun. The M30 is labeled as the best female percussion massage gun on their website. This massage gun retails for $189. It has five speed settings, six interchangeable attachments, up to seven hours of charge time, and an RPM range of 1200 to 3200 strokes per minute. And it also has a carbon fiber and plastic outer case, which is shatter resistant. Mutis was founded in 2017. Currently, they have three massage gun offerings on their site, ranging in price from $189 to $329. There's the M30 massage gun, which I'm showing you today. There's the M40 Pro Deep Tissue Massage Gun. And there's also the Ultra Professional Massage Gun meant for athletes. Unrelated but also listed on their site are e-toothbrushes and a negative ion hairdryer resembling the Dyson. Today's video will be broken down into the following topic areas. First, I'm gonna go over the product details. Next, I'm gonna talk about my first impression. I'm also gonna talk about the benefits of percussion therapy. And lastly, I'm gonna go over my overall opinion on this product. So now for a few details on this product, the base unit portion weighs 1.76 pounds. Here is the power button. You just hold it a few seconds to turn it on. And you can see we're on the lowest speed. Press it again to increase the speed. And that's the highest speed. This massage gun has five speed settings with an RPM range of 1200 to 3200 strokes per minute. Here is the instruction manual. In the user guide, here's a depiction of the various attachments and their recommended uses. Now I'm gonna go over the various attachments. The first attachment we have is the ball head attachment, which is great for large muscle groups such as the quads or the glutes. Next we have the shape head, which is great for the spine, neck, and calves. We also have the flat head, which is great for general applications. We have the bullet head, which is great for deep tissue joints. We also have a semicircle metal head, which is also great for deep tissue. And lastly, we have this metal head, which is great for the entire body. So these two metal attachments, they look heavy, but they're actually not heavy. I feel like this is just like a metal coating. So yeah, it's not like heavy at all to hold. These attachments are intended for sensitive users. So go ahead and give this a try if you're new to like percussion therapy or just want something a little bit more mild. So I'm gonna try the flat head, which is intended for general applications. What I find right off the bat is that if you use this at the lowest setting, it is a little bit more jerky feeling. I find it to be a lot smoother if you increase the speed. I'm now gonna try the spinal head and use it on my neck. So for me, I don't really suffer from neck pain. I feel like this is a little bit like abrasive feeling. I feel like it's shaking my entire head while using this. Now I'm gonna try the bullet head, which is meant for deep tissue. And they also say that you can use it for the wrist. So that's what I'm gonna try. So that one's actually not too bad. I wanna be careful not to put too much pressure because I just don't wanna hurt myself. Here we have the flat metal head, which is also used for general applications and also intended for like female or sensitive users. So I do feel that this metal head is a little bit more gentle on my skin. I was trying to get like the upper back portion, but I am limited to how far my arms will reach. It may be great if someone else can help do it for you, especially if you have like back pain. We also have the semicircle metal head, which is once again meant for sensitive users and can reach deep tissue. I think this attachment is pretty good for the forearm. I actually prefer it over the bullet attachment. I feel like the bullet attachment was a little bit too pinpointed for my liking. And here we have the ball head attachment, which is meant for the large muscle groups, such as your glutes or your quads. So I'm gonna try it on my quads. So at the lowest speed, it does feel a little bit jerky, so I would recommend to upping the speed. And naturally, you can vary your results based on the amount of pressure that you put So for a few benefits of percussion therapy, the first benefit is that you'll get instant muscle relief from the buildup of lactic acid. As you may know, lactic acid is produced while you exercise. Another benefit to percussion therapy is that you can also improve muscle responsiveness and your range of motion. 
And lastly, to tie everything together, you'll also accelerate muscle recovery, stimulate muscle growth, and enhance your flexibility. So now for some final thoughts on this product. Overall, I feel like it's quite powerful. As you may know, the base unit is 1.76 pounds, so it's not the lightest on the market. I feel like it does get a little bit heavy in my hand over time, especially if you're going for more hard to reach areas such as like your back area. On the base device, I do like this non-slip kind of brushed metal feel to it. I'm not sure if there's anything really comparable to percussion therapy. Say if you were to sit in a massage chair, it's not really the same thing. This product delivers up to 3,200 reps per minute with 60 pounds of stall force. It's one of the stronger ones on the market that I've tested. I do like that they include two metal head attachments for the sensitive users if you don't want something so intensive. Overall, I feel like this is a quality product and something that you can definitely benefit to use after your workout. So anyways, that should do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to like this video and comment down below what is your thought on this product. Do you feel like it's worth it for the price point or would you prefer something a little bit less expensive and more lightweight? If you're interested in trying this product out for yourself, I do have a 20% off discount code and I'll leave it in the description box below. If you're not already, be sure to subscribe if you like content like this and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.